the present I want to give you is... A wind glider! Outriders use them to ride the wind, and the people of Mondstadt love using them too. I brought you here to give it to you, so you can experience it right away. Wow, you're really excited about these wind gliders, huh? Well, that's because the wind is the heart and soul of Mondstadt. <sighs> Alrighty then, enough talk. Let's give it a whirl. It's easy to use, but you still need to pay attention to my instructions. The sky! your fall with the power of a thousand winds. Now, concentrate. See yourself grasping the wind. Harness its energy. Who said that? got the power to go up against the dragon. Are you a new ally? Or a new storm? Storm Terror is attacking Mondstadt itself! Kaya, Traveler, you've come at the right time. We must... Hold on, Amber. Are you perhaps forgetting to introduce us? Oh, right. This is Kaya, our cavalry captain. These two are travelers from afar. From afar? Is that all we know of them? Uh, long story short... I see. Welcome to Mondstadt. Uh, though you haven't arrived at the best of times, I'm afraid. I understand the anguish of being separated from family. I'm not really sure why you're looking for the Animo God. But everyone has their secrets, right? <laughs> Relax. I won't press you for more. First and foremost, on behalf of the Knights of Favonius, I would like to extend our thanks to you for your help just now. Your fight to defend the city against the dragon just now was witnessed by no small number of citizens. 
The acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius is also very interested in meeting you, and formally invites you both to our headquarters. I've heard that if you give tavern owners a considerable tip, they'll be willing to share some information on the down low. Cider! Ah, so if you want, I've heard it's time for Paimon's little life tips. Little life tips? In Mondstadt, if there's something you can't fix, or there's something you. A reward on the road. This seems to be the Knights of Favonius headquarters. Let's head in. I'll keep this close. Jean, what's the hurry? I thought we agreed to meet them here. There have been sightings of storm terror outside the city. Once we meet, we must... Relax. I'll lend a hand when the time comes. Jean, I've brought them. <sighs> and once it was over, I brought them straight here. Mondstadt welcomes you, Windborn Travelers. I am Jean, acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius. 
This is Lisa, our resident librarian. <laughs> oh, are you sweeties here to help us out? <laughs> You're both so adorable. Sadly, the timing is regrettable. Storm Terror has caused quite a ruckus in the region since its recent resurgence. Simply put, Mondstadt's elemental sphere and ley lines are now akin to a yarn ball in the paws of a kitten. For a mage, it couldn't get much worse. My skin is one elemental particle away from a full-blown breakout. <sighs> if it weren't for this interference, the Knights of Favonius would have better ways to help you than just putting up missing person posters. We simply ask that you repose in Mondstadt while we help you seek out your brother. Paimon will help too. Good. In that case, we need a plan. With Storm Terror now directly attacking Mondstadt, we may have an opportunity to cut this problem off at the source. Lisa has revealed the sources of Storm Terror's power with her detection magic. Is that so? They're located in the abandoned Four Winds Temples. Storm Terror's ability to whip up these kinds of storms can be attributed to it drawing power from the temples. Our objective is to deal with three of the four temples. I trust everyone understands why we are only dealing with three. Paimon doesn't. Knights of Favonius, time is against us. The storm is rampant. There is no point in maintaining a defensive position. Alright, we need to take initiative and act before the situation escalates. <laughs> 